am going to start our presentation session. In the last class, I gave the topic. The topic was traffism, maybe. I hope that you have taken preparation about this topic. Today, we will show you the performance one by one. So, I will call you here one by one. So, first of all, I would like to invite Pulu. Pulu, please come here to tell something about this topic. The topic is traffic jam. <laughs> Good day everybody. Hope you guys are all are well by the grace of Almighty Allah. Today's presentation is about traffic jam and my presentation is consists of giving some answers of some particular questions. Uh, like what is traffic jam, how it happens, why it happens and what kinds of problems we have to face for traffic jam. And at the end of the presentation I will try to give you some solution for removing traffic jam from Bangladesh. So, okay, let's get started. You all know that Bangladesh is a small country and it is overpopulated and this overpopulation is creating various kinds of problems and the traffic jam is an ultimate result of overpopulation. Now what is traffic jam? Actually traffic jam is closing up of too many vehicles in one place. The place may be a street or a highway. It is not uncommon in our country, particularly in the Dhaka city. It happens when various kinds of vehicles want to move ahead of each other. The speed conditions and violating the traffic rules are the other reasons of traffic jam. In our country, the roads are insufficient and cannot accommodate the large number of bikers. Besides, the roads are too narrow and zigzag. And moreover, both the traffic police and the drivers are both careless about traffic jam. We feel much helpless and frustrated when we get stuck in the sea of traffic jam. Many people fail to attend their office duties in time. Many school going students also suffer a lot because they cannot attend their classes in time. And uh, I think, from my opinion, I think the worst victims of traffic jam are the patients carrying the ambulances to, uh, to the hospitals and clinics. Many rich coolers and drivers also suffer a lot because they lose their valuable time moving very slowly towards their destination. And the transportation of daily commodities also get delayed. That was the problem we have to face for traffic jam, but we can remove traffic jam. For removing traffic jam, we have to take some necessary measures very sternly. Like, I think, making flyover in the main crossing point, reducing the number of rickshaws, and improving the condition of the roads, and above all, I think, growing public awareness are necessary for removing traffic jam from Bangladesh. That was all about my opinion about traffic jam, and I don't want to prolong my speech anymore. Thank you very much. See you again another day with another topic. Mashallah.